All right, we're farming up some sap. Today, I'll just be honest with you, it's not the best weekly of all time. I believe the title of the first sap video in Ranked for this weekly is called When You Put the Frozen Weekly in the Oven and Then Fall Asleep. Ruka Doncic is a, an amazing name, just for the record. Um, but if you get a porcupine or a guinea fowl, you are popping off, brother. You are popping off. Sabretooth is amazing too, but you have to live long enough. Like, here's what the problem for me is that I feel like most of the time, if you don't get a porcupine or a guinea fowl on turn three or turn four, you're on basically zero HP by the time the uh, Sabretooth even comes to exist. But I will say there's, there's some things you can get up to this week that, that seem a little bit interesting, you know? I know streamers oftentimes get derided for um, suggesting there's stream sniping going on. I will say it hits a little different when every third person has uh, your name, like a reference to your name in their name. <laughs> Why is everybody's team better than mine every time? Like it's, it, we're, we're reaching in, insanity here. I'm going, this is honestly, if we get rinsed on this one, we're going straight back to arena. Every arena that I've done this week, eight, nine, 10 wins. Every ranked I've done this week has been a damn disaster. Arena's pure bliss these days. Don't give up. No, my ass is going back to arena, man. Ranked is getting too crazy. I'm a ranked junkie and I'm not touching it this week. It's this, it, it, honestly, there's, there's too much poker methodology going on here. People are like, oh, there's, there's too many sharks at the table. My ass is uh, taking the week off. I'm out here. I'm not doing any bankroll management whatsoever. My problem with this weekly is that there's no, like, stability in the mid game. Like, usually, they, we, they really, the best thing they ever did for SAP was making it so you can lose five times. And if you lose twice in the first two rounds, they give you like an HP refund. It gives you the chance to actually like rebuild. This week is, um, it runs counter to that design philosophy. And that's okay. I mean, not every weekly has to be like exactly the same. But yeah, we're, we're going straight back to arena, brother. If you're mad, be mad at the, the, the stream snipers who got in in the first game, because they've ruined it for everybody else. What's your percentile? I'm not looking at it. I'm not touching it. Hey, I lost to you round one. Shut the fuck up, Alex. <laughs> it's like saying we were playing uh, high low and I pulled a jack and you pulled a six. You know, the only thing that matters in round one is like what you get in the shop, okay? Yeah, yeah, I know I beat your ass when, we, when it turned into a game of skill, but when it was a game of chance, you rinsed me. No sandbag. Just, just own it. Just be like, you suck ass. Can't you play ASIM ranked? Yeah, that would probably fix it. Instead of having 90 seconds, all these like point dexters out here could have three weeks to come up with their move instead. This time we just got Porcupine and Sabretooth. No Guinea Fowl. It's a new era. It's not a new era. We're in a lot of trouble. Yeah, we're dead. Okay, well, four wins honestly is even better than we were doing in ranked. I would do this all day. Better than losing 35 ranking points to NL sweaty gym shorts. Let's go a little crazy. We got a pill. I'm willing to go four squatted. Just to see what we get. This seems like I could swap everybody's health and defense. And then the chili pepper would ruin their lives. Uh oh. oh! Yeah, I definitely see how Lionfish could do some interesting stuff this week, too. I mean, to, to be honest with you, it seems like you probably next round sell a pug and get a moose out there. The moose to buff the HP on the Lionfish, which then becomes the attack. Yes. 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 <laughs> We're not, not a big moose around, but still. 
Get hot swapped, you hoser. Dude, nothing hits like watching these guinea fowl porcupine teams get the shit beat out of them. This is like... Honestly, this is self-care. Holy, this is changing my damn life. It is what it is. You can't freeze them. Oh, oh, oh! A single one of the lionfish would have gone hard. Yo, equal sign smiley. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my media literacy to suggest that that is probably a Dan Giesling raid. Offline Dan raid. You're here for an incredible moment, okay? What can I say? We're on nine wins, zero lives lost so far in the worst weekly of all time. I'm so ready. I do feel bad because I know that somebody cooked this one, this one up individually. They cooked it up in the damn hopper and then it won like a popularity contest or something to be uh, to be included as the next weekly you're lucky if only I didn't overwrite my damn pita all I'm saying I'm not trying to be rude about it it's a situation where I would not say compliments to the chef I would say you you tried and trying is based what is, what is happening? This is a, it's a non-meta team. I'm scared, I'm intimidated, I don't know what to do. I know what to do! Easiest 10 piece of all time. Hoople bird badge? Well, well, well. <clears throat> I shouldn't say this because I don't like people using it against me, but Emu Sabretooth is busted. Listen, you're not wrong. All I'm gonna say, holy fuck, we got a draw. This is a dream come true. And also Corpse Slime, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. All I'm gonna say, okay, is that for me personally, everything pales in comparison to the power of getting a guinea fowl or a porcupine on turn three. If you, if you get that, then you can start to talk about the late game. But I wouldn't start making any late game plans unless... Uh, Unless you manage to find yourself in that ecosystem. Like, well, every team we lose to in the mid game is either guinea fowl or porcupine. It's, it's a slap in the face. Okay, this is a... I, I, I can't hate the player, okay? But I can hate the game. I do appreciate they mix it up a little bit here. They went guinea fowl and porcupine instead of just guinea fowl or porcupine. Daring today, aren't we? And Rex Mechanica, thank you for the gifted subscriptions, by the way. Thank you. Much appreciated. Another Porcupine Guinea Fowl. You love to see it. People who say they love this weekly are not beating the Guinea Fowl uh, love allegations. And that's fine. It's up to you. I don't know. I think we're going to get stuck at 6 or 7. I don't think we're getting to 10. But the snipes might be a little funny. Also, like, I just... <laughs> Team Wood. I'm just throwing this out. Do you see what you've done? It's been like nine rounds of, of a guinea fowl team in a row. It's too much. You're, I don't think I've ever seen an overcooked weekly this much. One animal is the, the only thing that dominates. It's crazy. Give Hyena a chance. We ran a Hyena in our first arena run. We our second arena run. The problem is the guinea fowl shows up at, in all likelihood, like fucking turn three. And then the hyena shows up at turn 500. This is not good. <laughs> You'd have to check my math on that one, but yeah, okay. I mean, we got eight. I think we, we did okay against some guinea fowl teams. I got to become what I hate. I think it's the only way. I have to get a guinea fowl, but only use that to live until we get a hyena. And then remove the guinea fowl from the ecosystem. Hyena. Tar. Ruin some lives. 
Interesting. <laughs> what do you think? It's definitely unusual. Oh, get flipped on! I'm so mad because the advice of just get a hyena actually like it bore fruit this time. That's so annoying. <laughs> it would be nice if the hyena went before the snipers. God, it's just it nothing beats seeing the guinea fowl team just get rolled over, man. Two chocolates. And that's not two chocolates. Those aren't pillows. There's a chance. Please do not uh, come to our chat and post your homework questions, okay? Get it! Good game! Good game! You hyena snake using motherfucker! Don't come to our chat and post homework questions, okay? That's what chat GPT is for. I'm a neuroscientist. Don't answer their question. It's below your pay grade, okay? You shouldn't even be watching my stream. Shouldn't you be doing brain surgery right now? I'm sorry to say, and you did it to yourself. It's a catch-22. Your skills are too valuable for you to take time off. You should have gone into a field where it, your commitment and value to society was lower. Then people wouldn't be so mad at you enjoying a little break or a tasty treat or something like that. But unfortunately, you are a brain surgeon, and as a result... I need to tell you to get back to work. There's people waiting for all sorts of therapies that you provide, okay? Yeah, if you're a web dev, people will beg you to take a vacation. No, honey, I can't change a vacation. We're in the middle of a six-week sprint to change the font from Times New Roman to Times New Roman italicized. Hey, we're, no, 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 I'm, honey, I can't go on vacation this summer. We have a really important project. We're rounding these square edges on all of the buttons on our website. We're moving the position of the button that everybody already knows where it is within the enterprise. We're moving it to the other side of the screen and collectively costing the company thousands of hours in labor uh, from people that can't find the button and then have to submit tickets to tech reports saying that the button is now missing. Yeah, but it makes more sense logically to have it in the top right corner in the hamburger menu instead of having it just sitting there on the top of the screen like it's not even thematically fitting with the, the layout of the CSS. Sorry, honey, I can't go on vacation this summer. We're moving around the order of all of the elements on the web page so that when you use tab, to auto go to the next field, it starts you at fucking name, then it takes you down to zip code, then it takes you up to address, then it goes to phone number, then it takes you to the, the capture that says I am not a robot, this shit doesn't even go up and down left to right anymore. <laughs> Makes me sick, dude. I'm not mad at the web devs, I know like it's their boss that's asking, well here's the thing, like you know, what do you do as a web dev? If you make the perfect website that looks beautiful, your ass isn't required anymore. So your boss asks you to change the damn, tighten up the graphics on page three, you're like, yes, sir. I understand. You know, your boss says, hey, I know we've just been using honey yellow for all of our uh, marketing materials so far, but we just patented a new hexadecimal code and this is going to be the unified color for our brand for the rest of time. We need to redo and reprint all of our marketing materials to change the, sh the shade of yellow to be like 3% less yellow. It's going to take us 10 months and you're going to get reprimanded severely if you happen to use uh, the wrong hexadecimal code. So I'm sorry. If you didn't want me to take the fucking guinea fowl, you shouldn't have taken it every single time in ranked mode, okay? But, 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 but I was stream sniping. Now you're doing arena and I want to watch you. Fuck you! Me reaping. Yes, yes, me sowing. Oh, what the fuck? Me making up somebody in my head to argue with? Yes! Lemur? I mean... He 
do be getting a lemur. <laughs> you do be getting a lemur. Put you right there. Oh man. Oh wow. Oh. Oh, that's a very strong dolphin though. And nevertheless, <laughs> it fucking does not matter at all. Dude! The the weekly being totally busted because of one animal? is amazing when you get that animal. I'm, I get it now. You do not kill the gold egg laying goose. What does it mean, Kate? What does it mean? You do not kill the gold egg laying goose. We need a moose, by the way. Thanks for reminding me. I don't think you know what you're talking about, quite frankly. <laughs> Understandable. <laughs> yes! And you all, you all laughed at me. You get the fuck out of there next. No, this time. This very time. Oh, but then I can't freeze this laddie. Oh, well, it doesn't matter too much. Okay. Moose, moose lionfish goes insane this week. Uh, not, not insane enough yet, but we got plenty of time. Why do you even want a moose? Just watch, okay, Karlaki, and you just don't don't do yourself a disservice. Just watch. Can I get something like half decent? No potatoes. Oh, okay, we're rolling then. I would love to see five. Can we? Oh, a royal flush. Lionfish, 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 lionfish. Me, I'll I'll take it. You're rinsed. Sorry. <laughs> you should be patting me on the back and shaking my hand every time a guinea fowl team gets beaten by the sniper team, okay? We're saving the meta one, one round at a time with secondhand information from chat. Okay, you're torched. You're torched. You're torched. I, we, nobody can beat this team. We just got a hold, okay? I did indeed see the clip of Jimmy Butler saying it's too expensive to fill up your Bugatti. This is high rate fucking robbery. Man, I'm trying to get some of this gas back. Bugattis, man. Cost him 145 bucks to fill up his Bugatti. Then he gets in and it's actually a Rolls Royce. I think I like Jimmy Butler. I don't know anything about what he's done on the court. Seems like a funny lad. Oh! <laughs> yes. Yes, I will. Oh! How could you? <laughs> and yet, how could you not? Oh, I would probably just sell you immediately, honestly. I think I might go crazy mode. I might buy you and sell you immediately. Pop you out here as a 2-8 with garlic. And get ready to taste my blade, quite frankly. Get ready to taste it. Nice guinea fowl, face rider. I love it. Yeah, maybe this weekly is actually good. It feels damn good. It feels damn good. After what we've been through this week. Oh, man. Oh, you shouldn't have. The hell, double falcon? Is this allowed? Well, seems like you're trying to run a cool team there, unfortunately. Your argument is invalid because I have a guinea fowl, so... Mm. <laughs> Blobfish meat? No? Okay. Uh, I don't really need it, but I uh, no, don't think it's that necessary, quite frankly. Pug is kind of tempting. You know what? I think we've established at this point that uh, that's not what I meant to buy. <laughs> I meant to buy the tar. <laughs> I uh, made a mistake. I 
I've made an error. An error in judgment. And unfortunately, I have a guinea fowl. So... Now real chocolate exists. I don't need your ass anymore. Obviously, you're gone. Let me see what we get off the level. That, that could change the game for us here. It's going to sound insane. Freeze me just in case we get a blobfish. <laughs> what, I, this is exactly what I wanted. I wanted a hyena. So now, I think, what if we just sold our guinea fowl? Because to be honest, I, I appreciate what it's done for us. But it didn't get us there. What if next turn we sold our guinea fowl and just started running a sniper team instead and then said like, whoa, 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 then we start shitting on the guinea fowl teams and going boom! You had the audacity to run a guinea fowl in this day and age? What's wrong with you, bro? Hang on, we're eating shit? Okay. I know what we must do. Man makes best term, turn of all time. Ask to stay. <laughs> well, guinea fowl team, bro. Really? Come on. What are you doing out here? Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, but next time you're cooked. I'm thinking. Honestly, I don't need a, a full squad to siphon buffs away from units that actually matter. Sorry. It's the damn truth. All right. Well, fuck you, Moose. Eat shit. Whatever. Who cares? I take it all back. <laughs> oh, yeah. You're lucky. Oh! I don't care. I'm going crazy mode. Go ahead, brother. Oh, I wish, I wish. Oh. <laughs> oh! Dude, you guys are right. The ranked is fucked this week. Arena is crazy though. And I did it without a guinea fowl. Yes, as I walk through the valley where I harvest my grain, I take a look at my wife and realize she's very plain. That's just perfect for an Amish like me. You know we shun fancy things like electricity. I don't remember all the, I, I don't remember the whole thing. I ain't ever punched a tourist even if he deserved it. An Amish with a tood, you know, that's unheard of. But I keep something and something so long that even Ezekiel thinks that my mind is gone. I'm a man with a plan, I'm into discipline. Got the Bible in my hand and a beard. Apparently I do remember the whole thing. <laughs>